Okay, neighbors, happy Good Friday. Today, I will be showing you how to cook Bohemian ball fish. Yes, you heard it correctly, Bohemian ball fish. So let's get started. Okay, neighbors, I have two pieces of bacon that I chopped, and I'm going to put this in my water, okay? I'm also going to put in some allspice seeds and some bay leaves. What I'm doing right now, I'm seasoning, what you call seasoning your pot. <laughs> yeah, child, because this ball fish, everything is going to be in the broth. I'm just going to add in all of just those, okay? Now, I seasoned my fish up earlier. I have some group of pieces that was seasoned earlier. So I'm just going to take my onions from off my group of pieces. And we're going to introduce all of that into the pot. Okay. All of that. Just all of that. Okay. And we're going to allow that to come to a boil. And once this comes to a boil, I'll add in my cut potatoes. Okay, neighbors, now that our pot is becoming, uh, beginning to boil, it's a, a low boil right now. So I'm just going to add my potatoes. Okay. I'm just going to add quite a bit. This was three, uh, three large potatoes. All right. Because my family, just like they like gravy, they like potatoes. <laughs> All right. Child, I wish you guys can smell inside my kitchen. It smells so divine. All right. So we're going to put a lid on top of this pot and allow to our potatoes to boil. And when our potatoes are like almost done, just a shy stick away from being done, we'll add in our fish. All right, neighbors. Our pot is at a rolling ball right now. <laughs> and our potatoes should be just about, they're done. This fish is gonna cook so fast, it's gonna be unbelievable. So what we'll do, at this point, okay, we'll just add our fish pieces right on top of, just right in the hot broth. Do you not see that? Child, I wish you guys can smell it. It smells amazing in here. Okay. Right there in the hot broth. And we're also okay. Just make sure everybody get in the pool. <laughs> Cause all of this child. Mm, it's not gonna take very long for this fish to cook. In five minutes, our fish should be totally done. I'm going to use the rest of my seasoning from the bowl. Because that's flavor. Okay. It's not a clear, clear broth. Ball fish broth. Because I'm using the remnants from the seasoning pan, and because I included the bacon, it's a little cloudy, but I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> the flavor is going to be everything in this, in this broth, okay? So we're going to relit our pan, our pot, okay? And I will see you guys in five minutes. Okay.
Okay, neighbors. Our ball fish is done. You can just skimp this little bit of froth off if you want. That's actually from um, where I put the bacon inside of this. Okay? I don't mind it. Okay? So now what we'll do, we'll add some fresh cut limes. And you just squeeze it in here. I wish you guys can smell what's going on up in this kitchen. Okay. We'll just use a whole line. Okay, guys. Then we're going to give this a nice little stir. All right. Stir them at the bottom, from the bottom. I'm just trying to think what part of this fish I want. Woo! You see that? I'm going to just rest that there. Woo! We're going to get some of our broth. Some potatoes. And I actually put a piece of yuca in my pot. All right, neighbors, there we go. Our bohemian ball fish. Neighbors, if you enjoyed this recipe, please give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below. Hit the subscription button if you have yet to subscribe. If not, what are you waiting on? It's just 99.99 free. Okay? So, neighbors, until next time, be safe. Stay blessed and stay prayed up. Bye now.